It was a reunion a half a century in the making. In 1966, Gettysburg College's football team captured its first and only Lambert Cup. Fifty years later, players returned to campus to celebrate the team that was honored as the best small college team in the nation. It was a day that sparked memories of what made that season so special. We just never gave up. Uh, We were behind in several games, and it just didn't seem to matter. We just played right to the very end, to the last whistle all the time. Uh, We had two great classes in the juniors and and sophomores, so I'd say we felt pretty special almost from the beginning of the season. Uh, It becomes even bigger knowing that this is the uh, this is the only Lambert Cup that uh, Gettysburg has ever uh, achieved uh, and the, uh, the the great work that we did as a team. Adding to the evening's atmosphere this was the first time many of the players had seen the trophy in person. Tri-captains, we went to the Hotel Pierre up in New York, and we actually received the Lambert Cup from the Lambert brothers, and it was quite honor. But the Cup never made it back to the school here for the players to actually see it. So this is going to be the first opportunity for them to see the Cup, and it's a major, major deal for the whole team. The evening also offered a chance for former players to reflect upon their roles with the team with the benefit of five decades of hindsight. As a captain, when you're uh, when you're playing, it has it, to me. It had one set of meanings. It was it was a great honor, and you did things during the year, and you tried to assume a leadership position. As you get older, though, and you look back and you understand the difference uh, in the responsibility that you had and the meaning it had, and what the team accomplished, and uh, and understanding, and then over the course of their lifetimes, it, it takes on an even bigger uh, pride, enjoyment. It's, it's something that uh, you get to treasure. It's just unbelievable.